Hola, I, my name is Margarita Pintado. Um, I am a Spanish professor in, at Pondoma, of course. Uh, I am also a poet, and this poem uh, belongs to my book, Ficción de Venado, right here. Uh, the Fiction of the Deer, it was published in um, 2012. Um, and I wrote this poem when I was a graduate student trying to make friends with other graduate students, um, sometimes unsuccessfully. Uh, the title of the poem is Adios. I, I write all my poetry in Spanish. I translated it, of course. Um, so it, the title is Goodbye in Spanish. Adios is goodbye, but it's also, if you separate it, if you say adios, it's to God. So there's a little bit of blame there. Goodbye. I told her that I believed in God, and she got scared. Then I tried to fix it by telling her that, as a poet, I was inclined to believe in a bunch of stuff, including God. I told her I had been raised in the Protestant church. She asked me if I had gotten over it yet. Over what? I responded. You don't really believe, right? And I just couldn't repress. Uh, Hell yeah, I believe. She looked at me as if she had seen the devil. She had come from India to New York as a baby. She was looking at me, but avoiding my eyes. She started to talk about reincarnation while making circles with her hands. She doubted everything. I am a political subject, she said proudly. I am a subject constructed by politics. Moving her hands, no longer in circles, but as if she were hot. I looked at her and thought about the beauty of her dark eyes, so full of ashes, ruins, travels. I didn't mean to scandalize her. I wanted to talk about life, about the eternal, about love, about hatred, about wars, about plagues, about poetry, about the ocean, about how to get to the ocean, about how about we go to the ocean? She got up somewhere between angry and disappointed. She took the soda she was drinking and said goodbye. Goodbye. I contemplated her, so beautiful, so slender, so willing to continue doubting. Me and everybody. That's when I knew I loved her. Her legs were two cords, making the universe tremble. I stayed alone, staring at her while she left, repeating stubbornly the word ocean. Thank you.